Continuons, Elex. Nous avons fait dans l'épisode précédent des transactions douteuses. On va partir désormais euh, sur des questions de poste à pourvoir. Viviane a besoin de techniciens compétents. Elle envisage trois candidats pour effectuer un travail. Rorik, Nira et Darel. Je dois interroger les trois candidats et lui recommander celui qui me semble le plus apte à accomplir la tâche. Euh, sachant que... Euh, donc c'est important, on va leur confier l'IA, le, les mechas qui défendent la cité, tout ça. Euh, et et, et. Donc, il faut qu'ils puissent travailler avec des clairs, euh, tout le tintouin. Ah oui, elle a des doutes à propos de Riley. Voilà. Donc Riley, il faudra qu'on fasse doublement gaffe. C'est pas ça que je voulais faire, je voulais juste euh, sauvegarder la partie, vu que je l'ai pas fait à la fin de l'épisode précédent. Ok. C'est par là-bas. Allons-y. Oh les frames. Alors alors, euh, par ici, plus haut, nous avons notre premier candidat. Premier candidat, venez sur le plateau. Bonjour, bonjour. Il est où Ah, il est sur le poutillon. C'est toi C'est toi le candidat Ah, c'est Caleb. Why were you allowed in? Euh... J'avais fait comment déjà Ah oui, j'avais... <rire> j'avais dénoncé les faux papiers, je crois. I'm a cleric. I should have known clerics wouldn't follow their own rules. This city is supposed to be sealed. No one is supposed to be allowed in. Mais je suppose que vous, clerics, devriez être allowed some privileges as thanks pour offrir nous all protection. Je ne voudrais pas avoir à faire avec les outlaws. Vous allez end up avec une ville ici, comme le Ford et Tavar Non, merci. Pas de mention des damn séparatistes ici. Ils peuvent dire qu'ils ne sont pas albes plus, mais vous ne pouvez pas les croire, quoi qu'ils soient. Qui êtes-vous Caleb. Je lead les berserkers qui ont choisi de se ici en Abessa. Ok. You are separate from the Berserkers and you're done? We have kept our beliefs, but left behind the laws. We have set our own rules here. Well, none of us are allowed to return to Edan now. Or we just end up being sent to the valley. As to why they came here, while well, the first settlers were sent to Abessa to plant a world heart to expand the forest of Edan out here. But they were cut off from Edan by the Alps, left on their own to survive. And after a while, they Alors, just a sur le côté. The warlords in Goliath weren't happy. But they're stretched too thin for another conflict, so here we are. And since they settled here, others have joined us. Some are escaped exiles, others just chose to leave Edan. Okay. What do you have against the Separatists? They are coming here, to our city. The only city with a real chance of peace among the factions. If it was up to me, then we would make sure these Alps went somewhere else. They might say we have the same goal, the same enemy, but I don't believe a word of what they say. Who says they aren't spies sent here to deactivate the dome? They can't be trusted. You want to have all the Separatists thrown out of the city? Yeah. And you know what? I have already started to make it happen. I'll recruit anyone who'll help get this done. We have an eyewitness who claims to have seen the Separatists exchanging information with the Alps. Traitorous bastards. Who is this eyewitness? The Berserker Yorg saw Fenk meet with an Alb in front of the city. Why would they meet if it wasn't to exchange information about the dome? Sadly, Yorg is the only one who's seen Fenk. And now mwah, mwah, mwah. Saying, he isn't sure he really saw Fenk meet an Alb from Zayquan. So I have to jog Yorg. Why is to to say Yorg? Sure he stops denying what he said. There has to be a way to do that. You don't think that Yorg could have been wrong in the first place? No, never. You can't trust these Separatists. They'll betray us sooner or later for sure. I'm telling you, this is just the beginning. I can make sure Yorg stops denying his story. You can? Do you think you can make Yorg stick to his original story? It's for the good of the city. So go to Yorg and make sure he doesn't talk. Either help jog his memory a bit, Or make sure he stays quiet. I don't care which. 
It can never be said again that the Albs might be innocent. Oh, ça sera à moi de de voir ça. Hey, you're new here in the city, right? Yes, I've just arrived. I thought so. I saw you come through the gate, you see. Anyway, okay, mec. I want to ask you something. Visiblement, tout le monde l'a vu. Have you been to Idan recently? To the Berserker city of Goliath, to be exact. A good friend of mine is still there. Who is your friend? His name is Kral. Oh, je m'en plus. He's at the Mana Shrine. At least, he was when I left. He thought he still had a chance to save his brother, Grimar, from the Alb Converter. Do you know what happened to him? Ah. Apparemment. Kral is dead. No. Apparemment. Moi, je m'en souviens plus, mais mon perso, oui. Bien joué, Jax. I had this feeling something bad would happen to him. First his brother and then him. A curse on all of Idan. And thanks anyways. Tell me about your life in Idan. Me? I was a worker at the pit. You know, I extracted Elix from old machines so it could be transmuted into mana. I always wanted to join the hooded crows and learn the art of magic, but it wasn't to be. My parents forbade me from trying. My clan told me to stop trying. Not that any of that stopped me. And that's what got me banished. I stole mana from the shrine to try and learn magic myself. And I got myself caught. Bien joué, Rorik. They sentenced me to exile in the Valley of the Damned, but I escaped. I'd seen the Dome City when I was sent on patrol, so when I left Idan, this was the place I thought of. And here I am. Vivian sent me. Is it about the technician job for the clerics? Yes. I'm interested, but I'm not sure that this is the job for me. I mean, I've not had much to do with technology. I've tried to learn since I came to Abessa, but I'm still only just starting out. So, now you've bon. left it. Niveau compétence, il est pas ouf. I'm grateful they let me in. They don't bother me, and I don't bother them. I'm not a berserker anymore. I live here. What experience do you have with technology? Well, back in Goliath, I used to take machines apart. There aren't many I've not seen from the inside. Strange, really. My job used to be to get rid of technology, but now all I want to do is put it back together. The clerics make some incredible things. I mean, just look at the dome. He couldn't talk on all shows, but he's all motivated, at least. Get orders you don't like. Will you run away from here like you did from a den? I don't know. But the clerics don't ban some people from doing some things and not others. If I want to learn about technology, they'll let me. They're the same with everyone. I've heard enough. Okay. Right. I'll see you then. Okay, donc Rorik, c'est le mec pas trop euh, compétent pour le moment, mais il est motivé. Il a l'air plutôt disposé à bosser avec les clercs. Euh. Le, le bon gars. Yeah. What do you want from me, cleric? To drive me off, or maybe even have me killed? You don't scare me. Your people are a plague upon this land. Although there is something different about you. Do you usually spend time with people like us? I know a lot of Albs. You do? There are few non-Albs who can say that. We could use more people who speak for us. Their free people fear us. That is an obstacle to our survival. Vivian sent me. About the technician job. I am without question the best candidate they will find. Therefore, selecting me is the logical choice. But I need proof that the clerics are really willing to work with me. If I am to work for the clerics, then I would like to be paid. The free people seem to value shards above all things, and so payment would be proof that they take me seriously. What are your qualifications for this job? I served as the battlefield technician for my unit in Zekor. 
I have already discovered errors in the AI systems of the cleric's men. Okay, okay. Elle est ouf. <laughs> Even the dome isn't running as efficiently as it could. That is another thing I could improve. Do you think you can work with the clerics? I think it would be better if this city was led by an alb or a machine. But I understand that it isn't up to me to determine this. So yes, I could imagine working with them in the existing circumstances, despite their inefficiencies. Hmm. Recevoir un paiement de 500 éclats ou je ne te paierai rien. La question c'est est-ce qu'on veut que ce soit Nira quoi parce que si on la paye euh, on va dire que c'est elle. Euh... Euh, je pense qu'il peut y avoir plus de friction humaine qu'avec le le Berserker qu'avec Rorik mais euh... à côté de ça elle a l'air ouf. En termes de compétences. Et il y a la question de, de l'autre quête à côté de les gens qui veulent se débarrasser des, des albes séparatistes quoi. Hmm. Hmm. Get your payment. Good. Then tell the clerics I can begin work immediately. J'ai payé d'avance. Are you here to seek shelter or to cause problems? This area is a sanctuary for refugees. There's nothing. C'est une habitude à Bessa de <rire> de m'interpeller comme ça. What's wrong with you? Have I done something to piss you off? Call it experience, but those in need and those willing to help don't normally question my motives. What brought you out here? This is a place away from the war. A place people can make up their minds without being pressured to join one of the factions. If the people here wanted to join a faction, they would have. But some people aren't ready for that. Or they've been cast out. To go somewhere. So there's no faction in charge here? Well, the clerics keep order, but it's not like the fort where entry means you have to join them. Here you can forget about factions. Are you always so edgy? You know you wouldn't need to defuse things if you didn't get people wound up in the first place. <laughs> Damn, this is like being back in Goliath all over again. You're a berserker. Is Adan trying to conquer a vessel? I don't answer to it, Dan. And these people belong to no faction. They belong only to themselves. I stand as their protector against anyone who would force them to do otherwise. My only connection to Adan is my magic. I wish it was more, but wishes don't make things so. Have you been exiled from Goliath? Exiled? No. There are those in Adan who want to use my magic for their own purposes. Ever since my power started to grow. They changed me. Their mana changed me, and that change just won't stop. I'm becoming stronger and stronger. It is terrifying. If that's true, why don't you use your super mage? I do. I have. But sometimes it overwhelms me. That's why I fight alone. If I lose control of a spell, there's a chance I could kill anyone and everyone around me. The warlords wanted to test me, try my powers, to harness them. Now I need to find a solution myself. But to do that, I need to study the properties of Elix, to learn more about it. I can use someone like you. Use? Mm-hmm, j'avoue. Elle n'arrête pas de nous dire qu'elle veut pas être un outil, et nous, on est en mode, je pourrais t'utiliser. I could help you. What do you know of what I need? What do you know of how to help me? Elix marks people. Mana, chems, exposure from food tainted by it. It stays with people. You have its mark on you. You're different somehow. What is it about you? Nouvelle mission, élu. I took Elix in the past. Is that what you're seeing? Or is there something else? Took it? You were fed it. You are an Alb soldier. Well, it seems we have something in common. We've both been fed Elix in one form or another. It's changed us. Oops. A micro. Neither of us know what that means we are now. What do you think? 
my offer still stands. And what exactly is it that you're planning? I am going to end this war by taking the fight to the Alexiters. And I'm trying to put together a group skilled enough to win that fight. And you think I'll take part in this? Carrément. Turn. C'est la méga mage. Your quest to find the elix you're searching for, then you can improve your magical abilities. You said yourself, the longer you are here, the more you fear your powers will overwhelm you. The longer you stay here, the more danger you put these people in. If you really want to protect them, you need to leave. Even if that's true, why should I leave with you? I was an owl. I know elix and I know magic. I know the impulses that follow you. During sleep, I know the nightmares and the problems of trying to control power that really wants to control you. Oh, yeah, Jacques, do you want to talk about it? All that is taken from me. We can help each other. We can discuss it, you and me. Not in the long term. You're right. I'm hiding from it here. I need to get out there and find a real solution. I'll wait by the main gate. Let me see if your actions can match your words. You should stock up here before we go. I will meet you by the gate. Just don't keep me waiting, or you might find I changed my mind. Ah bon. Bon. Ça qui est après. Euh... Tu 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 tu. Darrell. Ah, the gift and treasures of travel, for it brings new encounters. So what are you, merchant, bounty hunter, or a nobody like most people out there? <laughs> Was an owl once. And you go around admitting that, and you're still alive. How'd you manage that? Let's just say it's complicated. Yeah, I can imagine. You want anything to do with these separatists? Why are there so many of you guys coming to the Dome City? You'll have to ask the separatists. I'm not one of them. And I guess that's what I have to do. I was hoping you would have an answer, but as far as I see it, the way we are now, we should get along wonderfully with each other. I mean, otherwise, you wouldn't have even spoken to me, right? Ah bah moi c'est ton incroyable charisme, mec. Mais du coup y a pas de Riley. Mais y a l'autre à côté de moi aussi. Vivian sent me to talk to you about the technician's job. Yeah, good. And I'd like to apply for the job. And I'm willing to pay any price to get it. While I'm certain there must be people better qualified than me, there isn't anybody who will pay you as much as I will. Okay, donc lui il veut payer pour le le boulot. C'est trop bizarre. Heard enough. Okay. And remember to put in a good word for me with Vivian. I'll make it worth your while. Non, c'est une séparation normale. Okay, elle m'a trop stressé sur le côté là. Bon, le hors-la-loi, euh, c'est mort, hein. En tout cas, il veut payer pour... Euh, pour... Euh, avoir le job et tout, euh, c'est trop bizarre. Euh, il veut être un agent infiltré, c'est sûr. Euh, le, le berserker, euh, Rorik, c'est le bon gars. Euh, il ne connaît pas grand-chose, mais il est motivé. Donc si on se fait pas attaquer tout de suite, c'est bien. Si on se fait attaquer tout de suite, c'est mort. Et euh, l'albe séparatiste, euh, ben, <rire> c'est la plus talentueuse. Euh, faut la payer, mais j'ai déjà fait. Et par contre, euh, bah, c'est une albe, quoi. Donc, il euh, va falloir faire gaffe avec les, euh, les albes séparatistes à côté, euh, parce qu'on a des quêtes qui, de gens qui veulent s'en débarrasser. Pour les défendre. Alors, on a un million de trucs. Tell me about Naira. Naira is an elf separatist, so a bit of a long shot for loyalty. But she should have the technical ability. She's somewhere in the west of the city with the other separatists in the slums. You want to employ a separatist as a technician? We need someone, and I don't think your faction always says who you are. Elves are usually very good with technology, but you're right. I don't know if we can trust her. Tell me about Daryl. Daryl is an outlaw. He's applied to be a technician, but I don't know why. So I want to know his motives and what his technical experience is. I'm hoping you can get that information. 
If he's skilled and trustworthy, then employing him might show that we do trust outlaws here. But I don't know that much about him. I don't even know where to find him. What do you know about Rorik? Rorik is a berserker. I think I last saw him somewhere around Vito's pub. It might seem weird to consider a berserker, but I yeah, was once. And I know Rorik used to work extracting Elix from machines in Goliad, so he knows about technology. And I think I could teach him everything else that he needs to know. And it would show that we were reaching out to the berserkers who have come to the Dome City. Their magic is very powerful, and they're strong warriors. We will need their help if the elves attack us from Zagor. But it would be important to find out if he's prepared to have anything to do with technology, before we think of offering him the job. Myra wants to be paid in advance, if you want her to work for you. Then forget her. I want someone dedicated to the job, like the shards. Euh... Ah mais le truc c'est que les... Enfin, les... les éclats elles sont en mode euh, c'est pour qu'on prenne au sérieux quoi. Darrell c'est mort. Soit Auric soit Nira. Then you think she'll commit to us here? What convinced you about it? She's the best candidate by far. Is that so? She has the technical ability, and I think she will work hard for you. Well, if she's convinced you, then we should at least try her. Thank you for helping me with the selection. Here. Your payment, as promised. Si on n'était pas en temps de guerre. J'aurais euh, choisi Rorik, je pense. Parce que je pense que sur le long terme, c'est quelqu'un qui... qui peut donner de l'ambiance, quoi. Mais euh, là, en temps de guerre, on peut se faire attaquer de demain, tu vois. Je préfère qu'il y ait la personne qui, euh, qui voit les failles et qui les, <rire> qui les gère que... que juste quelqu'un qui est gentil, quoi. On verra bien ce qu'on a, <rire> qu a engendré. Euh... Donc là on a chopé élu euh, qui est dans les missions principales. Impressionnant. On va rester expulser les séparatistes. Berserker Caleb soupçonne les séparatistes de préparer un mauvais coup avec les albes de Xacor. Il espère persuader Aloha de bannir les séparatistes de la cité sous dôme. Caleb veut que je réduise Jorg au silence. Afin qu'il ne dise à personne qu'il a peut-être injustement accusé les Albes. Cela permettrait aux séparatistes Albes de rester dans la ville. Ok. Non, en tout cas, dans cet épisode, nous avons fait... Poste à pourvoir. On est parti sur, euh, sur Nira. On verra bien ce que ça donne. Hein.